So how'd that exercise go yesterday when you tried in the previous video? Did you really go there? Maybe go into the surface a little bit and maybe start to face something that you haven't wanted to face within yourself or about the world outside of yourself. We tend not to want to go where we haven't been. Uncharted territory. We don't know what we're going to find there. We might find pleasure, we might find pain. And one of the, uh, one of the principles that I think really rings true for so many people is that the human mind, when you tune into it as who you are, the human mind will go much, much further to avoid pain than it will to get pleasure. So my thought for your consideration today is, you know, to what extent am I willing to go within myself and explore what I find within my myself, within my heart? What does my heart want me to know about who I am and why I'm here? You now, if I ask questions about purpose and who I am, of my head, uh, I, I, I end up going in circles. I don't go anywhere. Because the, the mind, the way it's set up, the way that the egoic mind works is to always be dissatisfied. Always want more or something, or less of something. And yet when I ident identify with the heart and the soul as who I am, and I look to the heart and soul for calm, wisdom, happiness, all those things that I've been trained are, are just to be found outside of myself. Uh, then I can start to find truth about who I really am. Because my brain will never, will never take me there. At least not alone. The brain always wants scientific proof and validation for truth. Your heart says, trust me. Let me guide you. That's what your heart says. So my encouragement for your consideration today is to Tune into the feelings of your heart and trust the wisdom and the will of your heart as who you are. We've said it before, and it's, it's just worth repeating because it's so important. I trust my heart as who I am. I trust my soul as who I am. And I listen to the will and the wisdom of my heart to guide me.